Pop music icon Whitney Houston passed away Saturday afternoon at the age of 48. She was found unresponsive in her hotel room at the Beverly Hilton and declared dead after paramedics attempted to revive her using CPR. The singer was at the hotel to attend an annual pre-Grammy party hosted by music executive Clive Davis. The daughter of gospel singer Sissy Houston, cousin of 60s pop singer Dionne Warwick, and goddaughter of music legend Aretha Franklin, Houston was born into a great line of performers. She'd grown up singing in the church, and it was Davis who was credited with discovering Houston's talent when she was 19, and the two remained close throughout the many ups and downs of her career and her tumultuous relationship with singer Bobby Brown. One of the top-selling artists in pop music history, with more than 55 million records sold in the U.S., she took home six Grammy Awards and was nominated 26 times. Her talent was also seen on screen, with leading roles in films such as The Bodyguard, Waiting to Exhale, and The Preacher's Wife. The news of her passing on the eve of the Grammys came as a shock to many. The singer, who'd ruled the music charts throughout much of the 1980s and 90s, had struggled with drug and alcohol abuse in recent years. The Grammy Awards are scheduled to feature a tribute this evening, which will be performed by Jennifer Hudson. She is survived by her daughter, Bobby Christina.